So everybody knows lately that I've been uh, training with Joe Coy. Now, we had this cute little game where he says jump and I say how high. And uh, I'm quite excited to say that he's letting me practice my material by opening up for other like comedians that I also am gassed that I have the opportunity to even be a part of. And that's Andrew Schultz. Andrew is an up and coming uh, legend. I think he's going to be one of the biggest people in this industry on the fact that he does not care what people think. He is a legit comedian that will say what he feels and how he feels. Uh, and to be honest, I look up to him in that aspect because a lot of people nowadays are scared to talk. So today I'm going to Arizona to open up for a comedian by the name of Andrew Schultz. Hi, Tommy! Oh my gosh! Hi! Hi. Uh, oh my god, it smells like a wedding in here. Hi! Hi! Come here! Oh my god, you cut his hair too so you can look fresh, perhaps? Get him running through this, like, you can get fresh cinematic shots in here. <laughs> Dude, this is beautiful. Jerky, look at your beard. I know, it's yeah, really good. Yeah. This is this is the hair and beard combo I can get behind. They're at our house right now. I mean, they're probably asleep. Well, yeah, no. Who's this dude? Huh? Who is that? Who is that? I don't know. Why is he waving? Just ask him. No, 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 Georgie. It's one thirty. Let's just not. What the is he doing? No, let's just not. Are the is the door locked? No. Lock the door. Why? Let's just not. Because well, you're not here when we're here, so let's just not attract more attention. I mean, he has sandals on. I don't care. <laughs> oh, he's an old guy. Okay, Aaron, yeah, he can still kill us. I'm not understanding. It's hard for all laying down, bleeding out, yeah. eye to eye, and you're like, let's you just said not. he was Did you made him? What's up, man? Father. George. Nice to meet you. I'm Garrett. Pleasure. Garrett? Garrett, yeah. Garrett, nice to meet you. I just came to visit my dad and just sitting here with his Middle Eastern friends. The kid, uh, he's waiting. I'm going to call him. Stop. Stop. Why is your dick so small? What happened to you? Hey. What happened? Allah. When you grow, does it shrink? No. What happened? It's getting longer. Is it not? It's still Kelly. <laughs> yeah. uh, I'm at my dad's store right now. I'm going to give you guys a little behind the scenes of how. Hey, man. Hey, man. Don't do that. What? Me grabbing your dick? Stop. I will, I, will, I will not show it. Do your, do your guys' children grab your dick? <laughs> Never? Never? Uh, you guys don't have a bond with your kid. <laughs> Stop. I want to talk to you. Come over here. Hello. You, you want to meet my son? Yeah. I'm right here, buddy. Right here. Hello. Hey. Hi. <laughs> What's your name? Aaron. Aaron? Aaron, you're so cute, dude. You watch my stuff? What? You watch my stuff? Yeah. Well, you're a part of my stuff now. My dad called me. He goes, hey, I need you to come all the way from California to meet this kid. And so I came just for you. You're a good kid. Thanks. He says you get into a lot of trouble. He no. says you're a bad boy. No. You get all the girls. No. <laughs> I like your flops. Thanks. Dude, I love your personality. This is great. <laughs> He's awesome. Nice to meet you. Oh, hi, I'm Sonia. George. This is <laughs> pleasure. Mom. And this is Dad in the corner. Oh, are you? <laughs> oh, I think. He's behind the scenes. I was I just uh, about to call 911. I was oh, like, who's this guy? Like, who's this Honestly, look Take at him. <laughs> look at him. He's just like trying to hide his identity. <laughs> Not here. <laughs> when I was your age, this whole place right here was my whole childhood. You are living the exact way that I lived growing up. He was dancing Aww. outside in the back of the yard. We had a here. basketball hoop. We did all, you like to play basketball? No. What do you like, play soccer? Or what do you like to play? I like playing video games. That's <laughs> it. Hey, there's money in that, Pops. Don't hate on it. I'm my best. I'm my best. I'm <laughs> that, that's my man. Yeah, sure. You let me know if you ever play video games or record it. Send it to me. I'd love to watch it. OK. All right? You keep doing good. Okay. I'm very proud of you. Uh, Aaron, what I'm about to do, never do this. But this is how I used to upset my father every day. He's, when he was at work, I would just jump up here. <sighs> when I was a kid, I used to do that. That was a longer drop. Before, I used to, every time I used to come down, I was like, this is the day I might die. But it was worth it every time. Let me show you guys the inside where I used to do more shenanigans. Come on out. 
Now I have talked about me being in this liquor store many times and I've probably already shown this, but for Bubba Town, I wanna shoot a professional, nice video for you guys to see my childhood because I know how much you guys uh, truly don't give a shit, but it's still fun. Um, so guys, check this out. If you ever watch my stand up, if you're a part of the club, that bulletproof joke, this is like where I'm talking to the money dispenser. It's, this is the, this is like a legit, these are not made up stories. Uh, let me, let me come on over here. All this is new before it was like an aisle. But when I was a kid, uh, my dad wanted me to spend time with him. And uh, um, in summer, I was like, dad, I, I don't, I don't want to be at the liquor store. You know what I mean? Like we're not that Middle Eastern. And he said, uh, no son, we are very Middle Eastern, but I make it very happy for you. And I go, okay, what do you got? He, and so this is kind of cute. This is how much my dad loves me. He built this little section for me, like a little kid's room where he had a TV and all these like tiny games. And then he said, yo, you could sit here, watch all the movies and all the Pokemon, because at the time we watched Pokemon. There's a McDonald's next door, so when I was here, he'd get me breakfast there. And then he said, I can have full range on snacks as long as it's a, an okay amount. I'm not gonna grow up to have diabetes. But for a child, it's a pretty impressive gesture. Uh, these guys are all over here lined up like they're at the TSA. Hey guys, could you, I need to shoot a video. This is not the airport. You guys are gonna be gathered for a random search. Thank you so much. So. My dad used to yell at me because a lot of you guys know I like to freestyle. Uh, I learned how to freestyle in this cooler because I would straight be chilling in here, literally. I'm gonna show you, come on. I would sit right here with my feet up or I would sit back there. When I was a kid, I would fit a little bit better, but I would literally sit there with the CD player of like beats or, uh, or instrumentals uh, anywhere from Mozart to uh, freaking D12 or Mario or, or uh, uh, Usher, uh, all these old school stuff. And I would just sit there and listen to how they sang the song. And then I would tell my version of it. Like, like they, it's like they were talking to me like a musical and then I would talk back. Uh, and it was funny because I would be so into it, like legit. Imagine me as a kid, I'd be like, and then I told it that I want a bit to that. And the people would try to get their drink and they're like, what the f***? <laughs> And they'd walk away being like, that that guy's liquor store, I'm pretty sure he stuffs children in the in the freezer. But damn, he has some cold beer. This so is my customer, eat. Chico. And this is his really cousin. What's Chico mean? Is that your name? <laughs> no, it's not. What's Chico mean? No, sh because sh like a small. Chico means small? Small. Oh, so you're playing on the fun of him being big. <laughs> Got it, I like it, I like it. All right, let's get out of here before he beats us up. <laughs> I'm excited, man. You want a drink or something? Uh, nope. Don't want to get drunk before I get on stage. Water? Yes, <laughs> I love water. Do you go on stage prepared or do you rip it every time? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I have ideas. You know, I have ideas I want to talk about. I have, like, certain jokes that I'll definitely want to, like, do. But then, you know, whatever presents itself. You know, I DM'd uh, Logan your video, like, two years ago. You were just... You were roasting a kid in a wheelchair. Yeah, that kid was That's great. A good one. It was, it was so great. funny. It was so good. And I was like, he came back you said, yo, you said, get up and say that shit to my face. <laughs> and, I, and I was like, yes. And in the beginning of this video, I said, we need Schultz because dude, you don't have a muzzle on you. Mm -hmm. And I feel like everybody does. Yeah, like when yeah. you were talking about uh, Jeffrey Star was it on the podcast, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. I had to leave because I was like, oh my God, yeah. I don't want to. Nobody got upset. Nobody did. And dude, I tell it all the time, I'm super blessed to have the, the the moments that I had. Like yeah. I just came back from Puerto Rico. Yeah. And then came back, shot a podcast, and then uh, did some stuff with the movie that we're doing, and it's just like every day I'm just kind of like, oh, this is a blessing. So. I didn't get fired. The word fired is, is you said, oh, not me. Oh, you guys fired Mike? Yeah. No, listen. No, I heard about this. Yeah, yeah. I didn't fire anybody. It's not in Georgia. It's impulsive. We should I, hire Mike, actually. Yeah, we I think should, we're going to hire use Mike, Mike, I think. You guys should definitely yeah. use Mike. Listen, Mike's a great friend. They just got in a tiny bit of a... I'm trying to bust his ball. You busted the <laughs> f*** out of They're it. They're busted. Look at him. He does this whole <laughs> thing about how grateful he is. He's not grateful. He's a off the camera. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm so grateful. Everything's amazing. Don't believe it at all. It's just great for the album. You only get away with saying this because you look Mexican. You're not even Mexican. I'm in Arizona. <laughs> yeah. uh, I just tell us it was beard. That's what it is. I am super dope. Great big beard. Right yeah, I mean, your shit can't even connect to here. I know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, I'm tossing you up. This shit's like old clothes, and then you like pencil it with a little. <laughs> <laughs> feeling like a man. <laughs> <laughs> 
Multiplies into hundreds, bro. That's what yeah, you guys look like good people. Why? How did you guys get mixed in with Schultz? What? This comes we just with content. content. <laughs> you guys do content? Yeah. yeah. He, he, I came out of the room. He answered it so seriously. <laughs> I'm not beefing with anybody. Yeah. Stop writing you definitely the... You definitely oh, man. man. You're beefing, dude. <laughs> You're absolutely beefing. I didn't Where's say that? or do anything uh, at all. Zero. Yeah. You know who you are? What's that? You're like a, you stir up I the stir clickbait. Up. I stir you stir up the clickbait. You, you don't like do. drama alerts, you take notes from you. Because <laughs> <laughs> at least you're funny with He's it. He's a fan. He's a fan. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure he is. <laughs> Just wait till I'm 37, bro. I'm gonna come at you and be like, oh yeah, why are you teasing with your bullshit? <laughs> <laughs> Okay guys, shall we roll over there? Yeah.